At Norco High School, a family feel is as much a part of their tradition as a record 28 consecutive CIF playoff appearances. Toby Gearhart, the 2009 Heisman Trophy runner-up at Stanford, and his younger brother Garth played for the Cougars under their father Todd, who was the team's head coach at the time. Troy Dye, a senior safety at Norco, is the latest player with family ties to the coaching staff. His older brother Tony is the defensive coordinator. On the field, it's just Coach Dye to me. When I'm off the field, it's my brother. And in the film room is Coach Die. so whenever it involves football around other people is Coach Die. Tony was a safety at UCLA before signing with the Cincinnati Bengals in 2012. After a brief stint in the NFL, he was medically advised to quit football due to a heart issue. Now, in his second season coaching at Norco, Tony's watched his younger brother become the face of their defense. He's a real good listener. Um, Obviously, he can get the job done physically, so it makes my job a lot easier. Um, other than that, I mean, we keep a nice, solid coach-player relationship on the field, but then when we get home, I still make fun of him quite a bit, you know, push him on the ground, kick dirt in his face, that kind of thing. Gaining first-hand knowledge from Tony's experience playing at a Division I school and in the NFL has been invaluable for Troy as he tries to follow in his brother's footsteps. It's great, actually, because, you know, you teach me the little techniques and little ins and out of the game that you wouldn't really get from a normal coach. So coming from him, it's really cool because it's my brother. He's been through it. He's lived it. I know, he's, I know he knows what he's talking about. So having that in my back pocket is really great. A heavy recruitment included an initial offer from the University of Colorado after his sophomore season. Since then, the floodgates opened, and Troy announced the Oregon Ducks had won him over. I think Oregon's a great fit for him and his skill set. I think he's going to be phenomenal there. Uh, a lot of Pac-12 schools wanted him, and I could see why they'd want him. He can do a lot of things. He can play offense if we needed him to. He can play multiple positions, and he's got a great big frame with a lot of potential to do a lot of things. As for Tony's opinion on his brother's college choice? As long as he's in the Pac-12, it's okay with me. I knew he wanted to kind of blaze his own path and um, not go to UCLA, and that was completely fine with me. Um, I'm not going to be a Duck fan, but I will be a Troy Dye fan. It will be an interesting day in the Dye household the first time Tony's alma mater, UCLA, takes on Troy and the Ducks. For Fox Sports West, I'm Kristen Kirby reporting from the Cronkite Sports Bureau in Los Angeles.